European Union has announced severe additional sanctions against Russia over its invasion of Ukraine. Along with taking the unprecedented step of financing and delivering arms to Ukraine, the bloc will close its airspace to all Russian aircraft. It aims to spend 450 million euros on weapons for Ukraine. That's over half a billion US dollars and a further 50 million euros will be devoted to humanitarian assistance including medical laws. For the first time ever the European Union will finance the purchase and delivery of weapons and other equipment to a country that is under attack. An EU Commission President Ursula van der Leyen also said the EU is closing its airspace to all Russian aircraft including the private jets of Russian oligarchs, the 27 plots, 27 nation bloc will also ban Russian state media outlets broadcasting throughout the European Union. It means that the Kremlin's television network, RT, and news agency, and radio station Sputnik will go off air across the EU from the Lion said, this was to render them unable to spread their lies to justify Putin's war. First, we are shutting down the EU airspace for Russians. We're proposing a prohibition on all Russian-owned, Russian-registered, and Russian-controlled aircraft. These aircraft will no more be able to land in takeoff or overfly the territory of the European Union. 2038 Let's go to our foreign correspondent, James Longman, who was inside Moscow and James sanctions already as we heard starting to have an impact there. Good morning. Let us write a good morning. Russia is becoming increasingly isolated. The entire European Union is now banned Russian aircraft from his airspace. A number of airlines have suspended services entirely. And that is why the United States has told all American